Hello all of you. In this video, we will see what are settlements and what are the different types of settlements. First, what do you understand by this term settlements? A settlement is a colony or a small community or a small place where people reside. In topographical map, it is shown in red color. Now three different types we have to do, nucleated or clustered, linear and the third one is scattered or dispersed. I have drawn these three boxes for you. One you can see all the huts are close to each other. There is metal road and other facilities are available, police chalky, temple, dark bungalow, dispensary etc. Name of this settlement is Anadra. This is the example of nucleated or clustered settlement. This type of settlement develops in the fertile area where the people can do agriculture and there are many offices where people can do their work. This is the example of economically well developed settlement. Second one we will see linear. You can see huts are also here but the design is different from the previous one. Here you can see blue, I have drawn river. On the both sides of river, you can see huts. People live here because availability of water, easy availability of water. The land is also fertile, so can, they can do agriculture here. And the soil is very soft, so many construction work can be done here. You can see the huts along both sides of the metal road or along the railway line. They develop around these because communication and transport facilities are available to people which help them in developing their trade. Third one you will see this is also different from the previous two. Here only few huts are there in this box and all those are also separated from each other. They are scattered from each other. This is the scattered or dispersed settlement. Now this settlement develop in the area which is uncultivable land, bad land or you can see this in the uh, deserted area or on the slopes of the hills etc. Because facilities are not available so people do not stay there. So very few huts you will find. Now how to identify all these three types in your topographical map? You can see here. And trolley is written here. All the houses are together. Here also you can see Sangla. All the houses are together. Third one you can see Bhatamal. All the houses. So all the examples are of nucleated settlements. Second you can see in here only there are grids. Different different grids where you can find only one hut or two huts are there. This is the example of scattered or dispersed settlement. Third, you will see this is the metal road and both sides of metal road, you will see huts are there. This is, you can see thin line that is your car track. Both sides of the car track, you will see huts are there. So this is the example of linear settlement. I'm sure by the end of this video, uh, you will be able to identify all three different types of settlements in your topographical map. If you are new to this channel, then please like and subscribe. Thank you.